Hello out there YouTube, this is a Sports Wolf coming at you with a pretty cool looking piece. It's the Transformers crossovers uh, from the Mar Marvel Universe. It's the uh, Wolverine. This is a repaint. And this is the, uh, the X-Force. Black and silver, black and chrome. Um, cooler version, if you will from the original, you know, yellow and whatever, uh, Wolverine. Um, this is actually a pretty cool line if you're into the whole Marvel thing. Um, I like them. Um, Wolverine's pretty, pretty cool customer, man. Let's take a look at the back of this package. Let's see, quick look here. Um, what is it? Uh, X-Men need dirty job done quietly. They turn to Wolverine and his X-Force. With his new battle suit designed for speed, stealth, firepower, Wolverine can accomplish the most dangerous missions without ever being seen. Wow. Yeah, pretty cool. He's even got a few little tricks that he can do. I like it. I like this one better than the, uh, the first one. That's why I'm doing the review on here. Um, he can be kind of tricky to transform. So let's uh, let's see what we can do with him here. Um, take a quick look. And uh, give you a 360. There's the back. There's underneath. Not a whole lot to him, but he is tricky. And you have to handle him with the little ease. Look at it, it's already coming apart on me. Um, quick comparison. Grab a... Compare him to Voyager Prime real quick. As you can see, he's a little bit heftier um, but, uh, Prime is still better. Don't matter. All right, back to where we were here. Um, let's see. Let's see what we can do here. First, we'll go ahead and... It's a lot, a lot of little things to him that you just want to... Be careful, some of these things will pop off. So the first thing you want to do, let's see, maybe kind of jostle them free a little bit. Get those legs right here. I don't know why that did that. Because these arms can be kind of tricky. But, well, at least for me anyway. So try to get them arms loose. Just jiggle them around a little bit. They'll slide out, as you can see right there. Push them back in. And you can take the grill and pull that down. Um, these wheels move in and out, and up and down. So make sure you leave them. Get this to pull these up. Then pull them, pull them legs apart. down the waist and then you can turn him around at the waist bring the legs down like so got these caps here you can bring the feet out if you want and these back heels you can bring down, leave just like that. Bam. Bam! Come on, get out of there. You know you want. Come on, get out of there. Stop hiding on me. There's a trick to this. Let's see. He pops. Oops. 
pops at the waist here. And he's pretty tough to get out of there. It's one of the little gimmicks. There we go. See? Right there. That's going to be confusing. Okay. Just spin it like so. Stop, stop, stop. See. And then tab them back in to waste here. Ha ha. Oops. Spin them back around. And there you have. Bring these back up again. They keep moving. And there you have the waist. And that was that could be tricky for some people. Push them wheels back in. Bring these arms. Slide that down. Put that back down there. You don't need to be anywhere. Just back there is fine. Bring them arms around. Bring them down. Next, a little bit of a trick here. Pull the head out. Lift up on the panel, as you can see. Slide that back. Grab him by his face. Come on now. Finish pulling him up the rest of the way until you hear him pop. Pull the grill down. This is up and down. Push that down. Make sure the shoulders are up a little bit. Make sure the arms are out. Push in these little pieces there. And there you go. There you go. Well, then you can, it's a matter of choice, you can spin that back up. Well, it's probably where it should go. Up out of the way. And then make sure that um, he's all pushed together. He can be kind of flippity and floppity or whatever, but and you can even move these in, these back pieces here, right there. You can move them in, you can move them out, you know, whatever, whatever you feel like doing. And there you go. And then there's buttons right here on his forearms. And pop, there goes his blades. Do that one more time. You lock in, push the button. Bam. And there you go. There you have it. Transformer Wolverine. God, this line is pretty cool. I mean, Transformers crossovers into anything would be cool. Of course, there's so many out there that already do transformations but they don't call them transformers but uh, Marvel transformers yeah pretty nice um, gotta love this guy he's got pretty good detail standard articulation you know at the knees come all the way down um, elbow all the way around no accessories doesn't come with anything just well what, is, what does he need adamantium blades slice just about anything right all right wolverine fans transformer collectors there you go marvel universe wolverine transformers crossovers any questions okay thanks for watching